I'm uh, listen. I, I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a fucking student of war. I know all the warriors from from Charlemagne, Achilles, the number one warrior of all warriors. From then Alexander, Napoleon, I know them all. I read them all. I studied them all. I know the art of fight. I know the art of war. That's all I ever studied. That's why I'm so feared. That's why they feared me when I was in the ring. Cause that's all my I was an annihilator. That's all I was born for. And now those days are gone. It's empty. I'm nothing. I'm working on being the art of humbleness. Can you be with me? That's the reason why I'm crying, because I'm not that person no more. And I miss them. Because sometimes I feel like a bitch. Because I don't want to, I don't want that person to come out, because if he comes out, hell is coming with him. Anyone could win a world basketball championship. Anybody could win the Grand Slam. But it's the people that could come back from the brink of destruction and almost down and out. When your manhood, your pride, everything is almost stripped and come back and conquer at the top of your game. Now that's the separation between a, a super champion and just an average champion. And when I'm in the ring, it stops. Every, all the nervousness and tension, it stops. It's not there no more. Because I'm facing reality. As soon as I get in the ring, it's a whole different story. I'm the killer then. Champion of the world, Mike Tyson. Then, his, then I illustrate my ring with bloodshed and pain. Then everybody has feared me. They're going to learn to respect the Barbarian King. There's no one to come back from that. means nothing. I've been champion. Had 12 defenses, fought all styles, every style, top men, everybody more experienced than me. Rockman, Rockman and those guys, they have, their eyes haven't seen what I've seen. I'm ordained for this, I've been to Valhalla, I've seen the most vicious and most cruel, the coldest white people in the world, they accept me. You can't stop me. I knew the nigga being one of the shortest heavyweights in the history and having the second shortest reach in history, and still I'm tremendously successful. Um, I'm in the ring, I believe in my mind, I'm putting in the effort, the sweat, the workout, the six, the six weeks, whatever it takes. I'm the best fighter in the world. And I've proved that by the, the champions that I've beaten to reach the point that I'm at now. So I have no doubts in my mind. When I'm into, there's no doubts I'm the best fighter in the world. Tonight, Gotham's relying on one man to save us all.